Hello and welcome back everyone, I'm Rumana Banana and this is Total War Warhammer. It's a campaign with Thorgrim Grudgeberry, he's right over here. And we're still at war with the Vampire Counts. We're about to actually, I think, absolutely demolish them. Hopefully, that's that's the goal. That's basically what we want to do. Stupid vampires, blood-sucking bastards. Going to go to raid stands, and uh, that's mainly because I really don't want to get attritioned. Uh, it will take us... Actually, next turn we will travel with the underway to te uh, Castle Tempelhof. Join with our other forces, move over, take this last, last thing, and then just hopefully absolutely annihilate them. That's the goal. And uh, it's a fair goal, I, th I would say. I mean, come on, those guys are... Real douchebags. Hmm, we still have minus two, but that should actually go away rather soon. Especially when you start building a gold mine. I mean, what's what would make you more happy than having a gold mine? I mean, of course, if you were a dwarf. So the vampire counts. Ah, uh, they're going to assassinate once one of our heroes again. Look at this, look at this freaking hero spam. It's so boring to watch. And it's annoying as hell. Can't, can't even tell you how annoying it is. Oh, would you look at that? We're raiding. Wait, what? We're, wait a minute. We're raiding ourselves and that's a problem? Double assessment failure? Alright, fine. Well, then don't do it. Also, Ungrim Iron Fist is back, but I won't swap him right now, because then he will just get assassinated before we can do anything, and that would be bad. Alright, got that. We're going to upgrade the guild marketplace for even more money. Because that's actually what we want let's see did we want to build anything here I can't remember actually darn it I mean I don't really know what could be good there damn it we don't need the food we don't well, actually let's go for money again uh, let's upgrade the gates of course uh, Oakenhammer is Still upgrading. Let's get a better iron mine. You stop using the underweight and you're going to resaddle this one. And that was actually pretty close. This guy could have tunneled through next turn and uh, could have taken it, theoretically. I mean, that's uh, Kalakian, of course, yeah. Another settlement for the dwarves. We could actually try and start to go for more diplomacy with the other holds so we can, you know, get them to join us. That would be good. But at the moment I think we are taking quite a hit on public order and some of these new, well, acquired, newly acquired cities. Let's go ahead and... Come on. Oh yeah, 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 right, because we just got this new thing. Perfect. Of course we're going to go for an edict here. We need less vampire corruption. I mean, 33% is just amazingly high. Ooh, ironclad. New achievement. Piss off. Piss off. Don't you dare. I mean, how can they still afford it? They have so many heroes. They have only one city left. How can they still afford to try and assassinate every turn? It's it's pretty it's pretty expensive. Uh, at least everyone failed. <laughs> Idiots. To be honest, these I I don't fear those two armies. They suck. Now that we are joined up here. We will wait for the next turn, I think, because we can't go any f further. 
We can go for 50, uh, still 50% of our movement range, and this is, I think, necessary that we get a little bit closer. Maybe over here. It's, I, I know it wasn't a hundred. It wasn't uh, as far as we could go, but I want to stick together, just in case they attack us. Come on. Because I think if one isn't in range of the others, then they could kill one army if they use both of theirs. Uh, it's hard to tell. Maybe not. Maybe not. But still, they, they could. They could. Let's take a look at our diplomacy. Because it looks like the Empire doesn't really like us. For whatever reason. Um, can we see that somewhere? The Empire. Yeah, here. See, it's neutral and we're deteriorating. Great power, they hate great power. And we trespassed. You know, it's fine. I don't want to... The Celestial College implores that I hear you. I remain unconvinced. You know, I, I'll give you... I, I'll give you... No, generous is a little bit high. I'll give you a medium gift. Oh, likelihood of success. High. No, we don't want your gold. Your stupid gold, keep it. Ah, now they like us a little bit more. That's good. The other dwarves don't like us that much. We could try and get Karagazul next, if we can. Anyone else that we could trade with? Why do you hate us, Border Princes? Really great power. They hate great power. For whatever reason. I don't, I don't know. We could trade with all of these. That would actually be good. The time for talk is over. Make your demands. See, we would make 700 gold per turn. Let's add a payment. Offer. Whoa, 60 grand? That's a little bit... Whoa. No, 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 no. Let's go for... Let's go for 6... Let's go for 6k. Are you kidding me? That's a lot of money. But okay, if you, if you don't want it. If you don't want it. Fine. I don't give a damn. Let's see if I keep it them. I, I don't. I really don't. It's, it's okay. I mean, I, I just... I don't know why I paid... Uh, the... I paid the Empire. Mainly because I... Oh my god. I think they killed somebody again. But yeah, mainly I, I just want to... Well, help them in their fight against <laughs> the scaling here. I mean, look at those guys. They rate they they punish them hard. Yeah, there we go. Has wounded. Okay, doesn't matter. Failure. I don't know if this is really important. Two guys came back. Okay, Angrim, you're up. Did you really assassinate? Wait, 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 wait. I think they got one of our... Yeah. They got one of our runesmiths. Uh, okay, now it's... Okay, it's time. It's just... I don't I don't give a damn anymore. Yes, to war, my friends. To war. Going to move here. And we're going to continue the siege. Of course we're going to do that. I am the Slayer King. And we're going to move as close as we can with Angrim. And he is running away, of course. And I want I want you to move as close as you can as well. But really you have to move through there, man. That would be good. Well let's save. Doesn't really matter that we do that, but still. Uh the Eternal Flame here, I want the 6% weapon damage on Angrim because he just uh, deals a lot of damage if he can. And uh, I'll resolve that. Boom. Get owned, vampires. Ah, 4,000. Eh, you'll need that cheapy crap. Just just die. That's that's basically what I'm, what I'm going at here. Just, just die. Angrim? He could reach him. Oh, that is that is 
That was amazing. We need to save here. Just in case. Angrim? Could you reach him as well? <gasps> he could as well. Don't really know if we need to, but leveling up. Get him. Ooh, that is actually closer than I would like. I think we're going to fight this on the field. I mean, I don't know this, but this kind of, uh, well, bleed-in area, this mixed area means. But you know what? We haven't fought on the field for quite some time. We're about 10 minutes into this episode. I think we could afford it. Even though Manfred von Karstein is pretty freaking strong, we need to be careful about this guy. We need to focus him down hard. But I think our Dwarf Warriors are, uh, are stronger than most of the Skeletons. Angrim could take down some of those Skeletons, maybe two, maybe even three on his own. Uh, his main part will be, uh, well, fighting the Vampire Count Manfred. We're going to use and drop a lot of bombs with our Gyrocopters. I think uh, we will also send out two or three of those units. And those, I mean, of course, are quarrelers to fire on on Manfred. He's the most he's the most dangerous, the most dangerous opponent that we have on the field here. Screw skeletons, really. I mean, anti-large. Yeah, good luck. At, uh, good luck with anti-large against dwarves. The load time is really long. This it's weird. That was faster. Maybe we use the slayers on Manfred as well. Not too sure about this though. I'm still not 100% sure how to use the Slayers. I I just need to experiment a little bit more, I think. But once again, I didn't really have the time or didn't want to take the time to play uh, because, you know, European Championship in football or soccer. Yeah, depends where you live. Took a crap ton of my time. Crap ton of my time. Well, well. All right, that should do it for, I think. I think we will use our gyros quite aggressively. But no, not the crutch throwers. Gyros will start in the woods, that's fine. Let's take our Take our standard, put them as far up as we can. He won't be able to really flank us here, I think, so... The thing is, Thunderers kinda suck, I feel. I, the problem is, the Quarrelers... The Quarrelers have a really cool advantage. They can shoot in an arc, while the Thunderers can't. And I don't like that. I will use the Slayers on the right flank and I'm trying to just come around here. I, I don't know. Maybe I use those guys and try to flank them from over here. They are hidden there, so that's fine. It's not really that great. That's not a really great idea, but should should work. Nah, it's fine. Let's just move you up. And the hammers, I feel like we need to hold in reserve as well. Once again, we have the huge advantage of having, uh, what's it called again, artillery, which they don't. So, I think we're just going to move in and try to kill those fast as we can. Are you really trying to flank me? Looks like it's... Pause for a second, so I can get a good drop. I think we're going to move over here. We are 
Yep, hopefully you're relentless. That's your job. Let's drop him here. And here. Oh, that wasn't a good one. Maybe a little bit premature. Oh, well, well it was okay-ish. Where is the hero? Let's try and fire on him. I don't need to run, you just move over. It's fine. Pause here for a second. Let's turn those guys a little bit, stretch them a little bit thinner. Mount Flight is kind of in the center, which is really bad for us. Uh, let's move you somewhere over there. That's a little bit too far, I think. I right, just move him here. The most important target is Manfred, there is no question about it. your target currently. Fire at the, uh, the most behind there. Get these guys over. Oh, his hero is almost dead already. No, that's good. Yep, yeah, there we go. Nope, that won't happen. I think they're done. Yep, they are done. Pretty much. Let those guys charge in here. Turn around the fire, doesn't matter. You shouldn't get caught over there, should be fine. Should send in the hammer, is now they come to think of it. Really firing there? Come on. You gotta be kidding me. And that's it. They're disintegrating, so we're done. There we go, and battle. That was pretty easy. Uh, they killed three and one of ours. Uh, it's, I think it's okay. Whoa, holy cow, 91. Not too bad, but 142 Iron Breakers. Uh, yeah, I didn't really use the hammers. I think, well, I gotta admit, the Thunderers did way more damage than I than I anticipated, really. They were great. Those Gyrocopters, I think the, those guys had the better bomb drop, so that was pretty good. And our range guys did actually very well as well. And there we go! We killed them and we got the Book of Azure. Doesn't do anything because we don't really need mana. Mana. However you want to call it. And actually, I think no, I won't. I won't go over the. I won't go over the border. As long as we're here, we're not in friendly territory. But at least we don't really have any attrition. But we could go for friendly territory. We could ask the empire. Wait a minute. We have a non-aggression pact. 
So let's ask him for defensive alliance. Ah, they won't do that. Hmm. It's interesting, even though we are pretty long friends. Or long time friends, we should say. Let's, let's pay. I don't want to pay 30k. What? Gotta be kidding. I think it's always um, 10% or something of, of your 1%, 10%, something like that. Let's go for 10,000. Okay, let's let's just go all out on this. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, fine. What about military access? Oh, we have military access, so we don't even... Okay, well, sorry. Ha <laughs> ha, yes, that's exactly what I was thinking. Oh, I thought he was level up. Oh, no, it's, it's the runesmith. All right, all right, get it, let's get dampening, fine. Actually, that should have been it for... Oh, oh no, 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 over there, there's the last... Okay, so Han Henrik Kemmler ran away like a chicken. Ah, damn it, we can't move this turn, so we're going to get some attrition at least. Going to camp here, though. Only take attrition once. Don't want to take it twice. Charakteroma. Hmm. I think we're going to get a gate here in Oakenhammer, and we're going to try and upgrade here. And then we're trying to get a gate as well, because this is just too... Too much of the border. It's just a border city and we don't like that. It's a, the border city to border city. Which is the little translation of Grenzstadt, by the way. Well, let's go! I think that was a pretty easy fight against the vampires there. Uh, they, I guess, want peace if they can. Or they will... Uh, yeah. No, did they assassinate him as well? Oh, come on. Stop that. It's getting ridiculously annoying. But we need... Try and war against... No, no thanks. I don't want to fight Tilea. Look, no, I don't want to fight Tilea right now. But the thing is, as long as they are actually kind of desperate for us to join the war, it means they will most likely accept a confederation. Which would be... Pretty good, because that's our victory condition, right? We need to hold all the dwarf holds. All the dwarf holds. Yeah, they actually did it again. <sighs> Ungrim Iron Fist, wounded. Oh. Fin hell. I want to... Okay, uh, give me a scout. Where did, where did Kemlo go? I know that he must be somewhere around here. For the wisdom of Valeria, I think it's easy. Valeria. We have we have a good enough army so we can scout for a... Good. What's it called again? A... Let us begin. Why can't you move? Oh, he got blocked. Fuck. No, he is in the encampment sense. Whoopsie. Oh, he's up there. Damn it. So he's trying to get maybe to Wartendor Wartenhof, maybe? It is time. So try and block... Let's try and assassinate him if we can. Okay, everybody needs to move there and fast. Haha, <laughs> we're going to eliminate those stupid vampires once and for all. Man, it would be amazing if we could do that, couldn't it? It would be, it would be. But I think we are out of time for this episode. So if you like what you saw, then please consider pressing the like button. That's not a great deal, and we really do hope that I see you in the next one when we try to catch Heinrich Kemmler, the last of the vampire armies. Maybe, but very likely. Anyways, thanks for watching, and as always, auf Wiedersehen.